Hey nerds, welcome to our Play or Pass series. I'm your host Joe Tweeten. Each week I take out new titles from the Game Pass Vault, take them for a spin and give you my thoughts on said title. And at the end of every video I leave you with a stamp of Play or Pass. Guys, welcome to SpongeBob SquarePants. Battle for Bikini Bottom, Rehydrated. A very unorthodox title for this channel indeed. However, it is a 2020 platform game developed by Purple Lamp Studios and published by THQ Nordic. It's available on every platform, as far as I can tell. And this will be my first time trying it. It just dropped this week on Game Pass. And although I know it's a little, it leans heavily more on the kid friendly side, I thought it'd be fun to drop down Nostalgia Lane here. Uh, guys, SpongeBob SquarePants, as a cartoon, has been around for nearly, good God, 20 years? Is that right? Leave a comment down below on this video, guys, if, uh, if you know the exact date. But I, I, I believe we're coming on two plus decades of this amazing cartoon um, that I was young enough to still enjoy and my kids uh, enjoy it today. And so I'm going to sample this, see if it's fun for either or, adults and or kids. The... The later, of course, which we probably know to be true. Guys, bear with me on this fun, nostalgic ride. Let's get to it! Welcome to Bikini Bottom, a normally peaceful undersea sanctuary. Today, it will be transformed into a theater of pure horror, wherein our little yellow friend will play the starring role. Today's the big day. I have devised an ingenious plan to finally steal the Krabby Patty formula. And if Bikini Bottom happens to get demolished in the process, oh well. <laughs> With my brand new Duplicatotron 3000, I'll clone an army of robots that will wreak mayhem and destruction at my command. One last review of the checklist. Let's see. Item number one, is Plankton a genius? Answer, yes! Okay, checklist complete. Throw in the switch! Oh, Welcome, my checklist, perfectly sir. obedient robot army. Hang on, I want to get a photo for my scrap. Oh, hey, hello? What do you think you're doing? Set to donut. Wait, wait, but I'm your master! I made you! No! No! Oh, my good China! <laughs> Another perfect day playing robots and racehorses. Yeah, only I keep getting the racehorses and the robots mixed up. Wouldn't it be great if we had real robots to play with, Patrick? I'd name mine Robo Jr. or Zorlon or maybe Frankie. Yeah, these unreal robots are getting boring. Hey, what if we put the robots in here? Oh, how shellfish of you. <laughs> it's not just any shell. It's my magic wishing shell. Wow, that's great, Patrick. So we put the toy robots in here. Okay. Then we say the magic wishing words and shake the magic wishing shell. Okay. Then we go to sleep, and in the morning, we'll have real robots to play with. But Patrick, aren't we going to say the magic wishing words? You already did. So, okay is the magic wishing word? It used to be Alakazama Alabala Wisna Tikitana Fushbar Griddle Bits Von Schnauzer, but I kept forgetting it. Are you sure this will work? 
Sure. <laughs> you didn't Last week, there. I only had one big cookie crumb and I was really hungry. So I put my cookie crumb in the magic wishing shell. Then I said the magic wishing word and shook it. And in the morning, I had lots of little cookie crumbs. Patrick, I proclaim that tomorrow is going to be the best day ever. Good night, SpongeBob. Good night, Patrick. The next morning. <laughs> gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with... Wow! Uh, Gary, did you do that? <laughs> Your bikini bottom stinks. What? <laughs> Yeah, Gary. It sure looks like we're in a doozy of a pickle. I think I'm gonna have to learn a lot in order to fix this mess. Meow. Meow. <laughs> Love me, Gary. What a fantastic idea! These signs will provide important tips to help me out. Um, how do I read the signs? Meow. Meow. Oh, okay. Press this button to read the signs. Mm. So if I want to come back and talk to you again, just walk up to you and press this button. I'd better get started now, Gary. I think that this is going to be a very long day. Very likely, yes. Explore the kitchen. Explore the bedroom. Explore the attic. Explore the closet. All right. Ooh, hey, we are playing our first 3D SpongeBob game ever. That looks really good, graphically. Your bikini bottom stinks. First off, gross. Oh, I love the double jump animation, that's funny. He looks up, like, affectionately, like, oh, he's excited to jump. Is this typewriter a save point? A note from Mr. Krabs! <sighs> and it even smells sweaty, just like him. SpongeBob! Contain yourself, dude! Ahoy there, SpongeBob! As a faithful crew member of the Krusty Krab, you've been, er, uh, promoted to head shiny object collector. Ooh, alright. As a faithful crew member of the Krusty Krab, you've. Uh, okay, I'm... Wow! A promotion! That's right! A promotion! So what this here new job entails is you collecting all these shiny objects that the robots are leaving behind and bringing them to me. Now stop seahorsing around and get busy collecting. Aha. Oh, like these things? Oh, we're collecting these things too? Okay, yep, this is a hardcore platforming. Look at that. Kelpo? The prize inside? But I want some of that. It's Well, I love me a good platformer with collectibles, so we'll see how this goes. But also, I tr I truly do adore the SpongeBob characters. <sighs> Shiny objects, valuable, yada yada. Yep. Okay, what's this? Oh, it's a sink. Nothing else in here. A fridge. Let's check out the various rooms. Aye, right, toilet paper roll. Well, several, I guess. Apparently, we don't need them. At least not yet. What's this? See how well he's doing by pressing the right trigger, okay? Yep, mm-hmm, right. Shiny objects that I have. How many golden spatulas I've collected? Ooh, Patrick's lost socks, ooh. Upper left corner, pairs of underwear that I have. Ooh, so many collectibles. <laughs> there we go, look at that. Oh, three underwear. 54 multicolored things. I don't have any spatulas yet. Ooh, we can we can swoop around and clean ourselves. That's cool. Okay. Gotta look around for every any any and everything collectible. Okay, it looks like we're done in here and there. I guys, you know, I you tell me if you feel this way too. If you're like close to my age, we'll say 30 something. Uh, and you grew up during any of these eras. Maybe a little Ooh, we unlock something. Uh, any of these eras where uh, they've made a lot of recent, like, cartoons into video games. 
Like, they're so good nowadays. Like, uh... Oh, one out of three. Okay, that's not one. Alright. Oh, can we open this? Nope. There's a picture of Sandy, her favorite squirrel under the water. What's this? Jump by pressing A while in mirror to double jump. Okay, double jump once per jump. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. Oh, oh, there we go. All right, we don't get much further there. What's this? Pair of SpongeBob's underwear. Every time he gets hit by a robot or touches dangerous objects or surfaces like this. Ooh, uh, has lost all his underwear. He must start in the area back over again. So it's my health bar. Cool. Okay, three pairs. Special pair of golden underwear hidden in the bikini bottom. Mm -hmm. More than three pairs at a time. All right, fascinating. Fresh like a spring breeze. Oh, good. That was me healing, basically. <laughs> okay. Hey, there's Gary. Hi, Gary. Aww. Give me some credit, Gary. I remember. Press this button to read the signs. <laughs> Okay, he's just reminding me, I guess. I make myself a snack, but there's no time. Oh my goodness, there's no time. Uh, spatula? Can we go in here? No, we don't have a uh, spatula yet. Nope. Bikini Bottom residents have been attacked by a raging torrent of robot horror. So much for fixing this quietly. <laughs> Authorities are not sure who is responsible for unleashing the mechanical menaces, but they have assured us that the person is in big, big trouble. Uh, uh -oh. ma makes sense. Did I say big trouble? I meant so enormous that it's hard to comprehend trouble. We'll keep you posted as this tragic story unfolds. Tragically, we're sure. I'm sure as well. Okay. Uh, what was in here? Okay, this room, my bedroom, and can I go out this, this is way? Where I keep all my old comic books. Ooh, nice. A literal library. Okay, can't do anything with that yet. There's X marks the spot on a few things. It shines. This is where I keep all my old comic books. Okay, not yet. Oh. Alright, we can hit it, but I don't think it means anything. Oh, we hit that. Okay. We hit that, which unlocked this space. This is where I keep all my old comic books. I know, SpongeBob. Goodness. This is where I keep all my old comic books. We're gonna say that that was a one-time spot. Okay, we're crawling over these this guys. This is where I keep all my old comic books. Oh, that was interesting. Okay. Oh, there we go. That is the slam down. It's like a classic, classic adventure game. You gotta have that. Okay, do I need to jump up to these guys to hit them? Let's try one more time. Nope. Where else could this lead us? Oh, right here? Oh, then there's this. Oh, we gotta get over there. Okay, hold on. What else do I need? Oh, press B. Here we go. Press B in midair. Double bounce attack. Press Y when on the ground. We'll do a bubble bash attack. 
bad, I guess. Um, to see how well SpongeBob is doing in every level of the game, press that, pause, that to select level, okay. Uh, but X and SpongeBob will do a bubble spin. Maybe may use the bubble spin to smash open tiki's or push buttons on walls to defeat most robots. Oh, interesting. Okay. This is where I keep all my old comic books. I guess I'm just gonna kill the tiki's. Yeah, you know what I mean. Hey, there we go. Boom. That works. Hey, what about this one? Oh, that did something. Ooh, a bouncy ball. That's going to lead to something good here. Maybe just to freaking hit that. Come on. There we go. Woo. Finally. We got the platforms unlocked. That only took me half a second. Because I'm an old fart when it comes to gameplay. Okay. Where's the lowest one? Lowest one's there. Crap. Oh, shoot. Alright, we're going to have to hit that one again, I think. Yep. All right, that's fine. Boy, Patrick will be glad to have this back. Okay, did I get them all? Was that it? I think I got them all. It would make sense if I did. Okay. So what else am I missing here? Okay, been in there, going here, been there. I need 50 of these. Oh, did I have enough? Oh, wow, I had more than enough. <laughs> I didn't even realize. Yeah, my first spatula! Yeah, my first achievement. Collect everything in SpongeBob's house. Including all his clothing. Look at that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Golden spatula are needed to unlock new areas of the Bikini Bottom. SpongeBob will need to. Oops. I, ah, there we go. Read. There. We'll need to collect many golden specialists in order to find and defeat the source of the rampaging robots. All right. So we done did we done did what we needed to do. A note from Mr. Crab. Ahoy there, SpongeBob. As a faithful crew member of the Krusty Krab, you've been er, promoted to head shiny object collector. Wow! A promotion. Of course. That's right, a promotion. So what this here new job entails is you collecting all these shiny objects that the robots are leaving behind and bringing them to me. Now stop seahorsing around and get busy collecting. Okay, sir, will do. It's a uh, shiny object, yep. Mm -hmm. Well, now do we get it? Oh, we've got one so we can now leave. Yay! We can actually go to Bikini Bottom. Or explore, rather. Ah, there's nothing like the sounds of your own neighborhood. Go away, SpongeBob. You're polluting my thinking space. Trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula again, eh, Plankton? Well, you won't get away with it. I've got bigger fish to fry. I've got to figure out how to regain control of the chum bucket from those robots. Where did they come from? Where? Um, I don't know. Not for me, though, that's for sure. They just showed up out of nowhere and started calling me rude names and throwing things. 
They even bent all my spoons. I love those spoons like they were my children. Oh no, not the spoons. That's terrible. Don't believe him, SpongeBob. Oh, won't you help me stop them before they bend all my forks? Not the forks. Of course I'll help. But wait, I'm supposed to go a whole to. lot of golden spatulas. Golden spatulas, eh? SpongeBob, if you could get me back into the chum bucket, I'll give you a bucket full of golden spatulas in your dreams. You've got a deal. Oh, SpongeBob, you silly maniac. I love this. This is so cool. This is literally, literally, physically exploring Bikini Bottom. All right, guys, that's going to wrap up my official first look at SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom. I was not around for the original release of this, but I am here for the rehydrated edition. And it's it's as whimsical as I expected and was hoping. Um, <laughs> guys, this might not be for everyone. And on my channel, I play a lot more serious things. Uh, so by no means is this like a regular thing. But with the Game Pass series that I've been doing... I love to sample everything under the sun that comes to Game Pass. This is another title that I would highly recommend to any of you out there old enough to have kids. I myself have three daughters, and this will appeal to at least one of them, being the youngest. Uh, but all my kids have loved and enjoyed SpongeBob uh, over the years, and I myself... SpongeBob is over 20 years old at this point, if you guys can believe that. And they still make episodes today. So, he's not irrelevant. He's a, a Nickelodeon classic. He's been around for a long time. Uh, the gameplay is easy, smooth, quirky, simple platforming. Platforming at its best. And it's the rehydrated edition right now, which is simply given a boost in resolution, just smoothing out everything, making things look good for the current consoles out there today. So guys, if you enjoy cartoon nostalgia, I recommend this. If you have children in middle school or younger, I will recommend this. And for those reasons, I give this a stamp of play. SpongeBob... SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom, although a lengthy, too much in the mouth title. It's on Game Pass, it's free, it's easy to play, and if you have kids, I highly recommend it. Guys, thanks for watching. Please consider hitting subscribe to this channel to keep up to date with all playthroughs, walkthroughs, first looks, and our podcasts. And as always, my gaming nerds, I'll see you on the other side.